The channel map function of VCDS can be used to help locate where live data for an item is found in a control module. To do this, you will make a baseline channel map of the control module and then a second channel map with the item in question in a different state by operating it or unplugging it and then compare the two channel maps. In this example, we want to find where data can be viewed for the airbag system's pod module in the passenger seat. So first we take a baseline channel map with the passenger seat empty. From the first screen of VCDS, go to Applications and then click on Controller Channel Map. We just want to do a single address, 15, for the airbag system. The function is set to measuring values and the output is set to pre-label file. Now click on Go. VCDS will connect to the control module and capture all the live data and save that data to a file in the logs folder where VCDS is installed. With the baseline channel map created, I now sit in the passenger seat and click on Go again to create the second channel map of the airbag system. Once this is complete, go back to the first screen of VCDS. Click on the small VCDS icon in the top left corner and from the drop down menu select Open VCDS Folder. This will open the folder where VCDS is installed. Go into the Logs folder to find the channel map files that were created. There are several free websites that you can use to compare two files, such as the website text-compare.com. You will need to copy the text content of the channel map files and paste them into the web page. In the Logs folder, right-click on the first channel map and go to Open With, then select Notepad. Once the file opens, select all the text and copy it. Now on the website, paste the text into the first box. Then do the same for the second channel map file and paste it into the second box, then click Compare. Now the differences between the two channel maps are highlighted and easy to spot, so in this example, I can note what IDE and MAS locations have changed. Now back in VCDS, I can go to those IDE and MAS locations in the airbag control module and view live data from the pod module. Additional information on this topic will be found on the Rostec web form. Please see the link in the description below.